Hi, I'm Wade from Thoroughbred Diesel, and today we're going to be showing you the ATS Arc Flow Manifold for the VP44 Dodge trucks. This is the ATS Arc Flow Intake Manifold for the 1998 to 2002 Dodge uh, VP44 equipped trucks. Now, ATS makes the Arc Flow Manifold for several different uh, makes and model diesel, light duty diesel applications, so check those out on our website if you're interested in one after watching this. Now, this is a cast aluminum, uh, cast aluminum intake manifold, very nicely done by ATS. Uh, so with ATS's theory on the, the arc flow manifold here, what they've done is they've made the transition very gradual from your intercooler pipe going into your intake. And what this does is this lets your, your air maintain the direction that it's going and the, and, and uh, the direction that it's going and the increase, the gradual increase in sizing of this manifold keeps you from running into turbulence. If this came from right from the uh, intake, uh, right from the intake uh, piping, went you know to whatever size it was, what that does is that would create a void there. So this maintains the, the velocity of the incoming air and it gradually gets bigger so the air is able to fill this chamber and then over into your intake manifold so you're getting uh, turbulence free air that makes it into the intake manifold so uh, very very nice as far as the design for that goes now the manifold features five extra ports for boost gauges water meth nitrous propane whatever you decide to use you've got three on the back here if you want to hook up uh, any of those things that we talked about there then there's two on the top right here if you need a couple of more port a couple more ports it does have the uh, it does have the standard on here to where you can uh, hook your oil gauge back up from the trucks and then it's of course it's got the ATS logo on here on a machine surface now one thing I really do like about this I wanted to mention on this intake manifold is they cast this lip that goes over where all of your connections at the back will be. So when you're looking at the truck from uh, above or from the side, it just cleans up the look of it. You don't have all those wires and, and kind of chintzy looking things on the back of it there uh, with that cover. Looking at it from the top, it's very, very clean look. Uh, looks really nice. Now the hardware kit that they send with this comes with all new stainless steel, uh, all new stainless steel bolts for everything. It has plugs that comes with it for all five ports on here to plug these holes if you don't want to run a boost gauge or anything like that. And of course it comes with the good old trusty Cummins uh, gasket. This is for above the intake air heater. Uh, this does leave the intake air heater in play for you VP44 guys. Got the gasket that comes along with that. Uh, for that. Now this thing, what is this going to do for you? Um, this is going to get you more airflow into your intake manifold. It's going to get you lower EGTs, quicker turbo spool up, better throttle response. Uh, so definitely going to be a, a nice thing. ATS claims that this thing can get you uh, up to another 10 to 15 horsepower. Uh, increase. We are going to be installing it on a truck that we have done an Aurora 3000 on. So we're going to be looking at how that complements the Aurora 3000 uh, with the Aurora 3000 from ATS, the uh, Pulse Flow Manifold, and now the Arc Flow uh, Intake Manifold to see how the three of those things come together for increasing the airflow to your truck. So I'm Wade from Thoroughbred Diesel. We're going to be linking you to any of those other videos inside of this video somewhere. Jim will do that for our installations and our unboxings of those other products. And then we'll also link you to the installation of this product on our truck. Thank you for watching.